Hey, good morning. Welcome back. Storm Tracker has rain showers exiting out to the east this morning. This is a loop of the last four hours. You can see how quickly these left and now we're left with mostly clear skies for the rest of the day. So if you need to do anything outside, you're looking for dry conditions. This is the day uh, early in the morning. Maybe uh, grass is still wet, pavement and you know, sidewalks still wet, but it's, they're going to dry up pretty fast. We got the mostly sunny sky. Not only that, we're going to have stronger winds out of the west all day long. So we're in the lower 40s. So while we do have the sunlight and you can avoid rain, it's probably not going to be that comfortable for you, at least compared to the last couple of days. You know, we're in a cool spot now. We've dropped in the upper 30s in Paris. And, you know, these are right where temperatures typically are on an October morning like this. But, you know, it's just much cooler than we've seen the last a couple of days. And, you know, as we move through the afternoon, that trend's going to continue where it looks nice. Temperatures aren't out of the ordinary, but we just aren't going to see temperatures that are anywhere near as high as they have been. We've seen temperatures in the lower 70s. We're going to be in the lower 60s today. And you see our future cast showing where these winds are coming in out of the west. They are going to pick up speed as we move through the rest of the afternoon, and they're going to become quite strong. So you can see we're still sunny. What cloud activity we do have is just not going to get rid of the sunlight in any way. And you know, these winds over the course of the afternoon, we could see wind gusts up to 40 miles an hour. Very strong uh, at any part of the year for wind gusts to be this strong. So just be careful. We are in fall, you know, where the leaves are on the ground and maybe you want to do some uh, open burning outside. Just be careful. I wouldn't, I would warn against it today because wind gusts are going to be strong. And then over the course of the day tomorrow in the afternoon, wind gusts are going to be strong as well. And you know, on a fall like day like today, even though we had rain over the course of the day yesterday, uh, some of that fire could get out of control. So just be safe, be safe rather than sorry. You can see those winds continue to be in a strong place over the course of the afternoon early evening and then they calm down somewhat tonight. This is around 11, but we are going to see over the course of the next day or so another round of strong winds, especially tomorrow afternoon. So just be careful. We're in the mid 60s. And you know when our temperatures are this low, this is the high for the afternoon and we have these strong winds, uh, you know, the low temperatures, the strong winds combined to create uncomfortable weather. And this is what I was talking about. It's sunny, but you know that breeze is just going to bring in more fall like air, maybe making you cooler over the course of the afternoon. You're gonna need warmer clothing all day long. Tonight, mid 30s, clear skies, cold conditions. Temperatures just a couple degrees above freezing, lower than they've been the last several days. So early tomorrow, it's going to be cold and then in the afternoon we're going to be a little bit warmer upper 60s mostly sunny still breezy in the afternoon seven day forecast shows temperatures stay in the mid 60s all weekend long and this is again the first weekend of covered bridge festival you're mostly sunny to begin everything upper 60s very nice fall like day a little breezy in the afternoon and then cloud cover rolls in saturday and you know a light sprinkle or two isn't out of the question we're mostly dry though with temperatures in the mid 60s before and even more substantial cool down with temperatures staying in the 30s consistently several of these nights.